Coming up on Press This, we're taking a look at MemberPress, the new king of the hill for membership plugins. Find out why you should buy it right this instant. Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Press This. I'm your host, Matt. And I'm Dan. Dan, it's always great to see you. Especially on a Pi Day like Especially today. Especially on a Pi Day like today. Uh, this is the show where we take awesome WordPress stuff, smash it together. Hopefully it teaches you a thing or two. We introduce some new ideas, plugins, themes, or whatever it is about WordPress uh, straight to your YouTube channels and maybe into your inbox if you're on the newsletter, slocumstudio.com slash subscribe. Uh, and also subscribe to us on YouTube by hitting the subscribe button. We want to hit five billion uh subscriptions on Absolutely. youtube we're right behind Sai, so we're, we're almost there we're almost there so we finished off uh, a whole series about membership plugins but we got a lot of requests for of requests. Uh, for from people fans super fans super fans throwing uh our super fans member press <laughs> uh for us to look at member press and uh, i reached out to the folks at member press they sent us an evaluation copy you got it we installed it we fell in love with it. Absolutely. Or at least I did. Oh, we both did. Um, <laughs> um, this is an insane plugin. Yeah, it's a great plugin. Um, it's, you know, it's doing all your, your standard membership stuff, mm -hmm. accounts, groups, mm -hmm. protecting pages, posts, yeah. pieces of content. Yeah. Um, but we talk a lot about the workflow and making sure that this is a, that these plugins that you're in every day, like, oh, I got to administer a user, this user canceled, or I need to move this person to another group because they want to upgrade, or, uh, you know, I want to set up another group because I'm running this other promotion. Mm -hmm. It's always important to know that these membership plugins are easy to use mm -hmm. um, and have enough features to cover those bases, right? Yep. And MemberPress does that uh, very, very well. Yeah, both on both accounts. It's uh, tons, of, tons of options, but not, not too many. Right. And you're not going to, there are, there are other for membership. I mean, this is the way to go as far as I'm concerned. I know we just went through all those other ones and I don't right. know how we missed this one. Cause this right. is insane. I don't know if it's yep. new or if we're just, we were just blind to it at that point. Um, it's definitely one of my favorites, if not my favorite member pro membership plugin we talked about. There are other plugins that do other aspects of this better. Like if you're looking for e-commerce, we have our whole e-commerce series and things like that. But this integrates some of that really well in that whole subscription based option uh, for you. You can even sell products this way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and, that, and that's kind of <clears throat> the twist that I, I like. And we go back to that workflow. And, and remember, we talk about like, hey, when you're picking a plugin, you're picking a plugin because of the cost, mm -hmm. uh, because, you know, you like the way it works. But you also should be considering, you know, who's supporting it? Mm -hmm. Who is this? You know, how do they think? How do they create the workflow? Mm -hmm. Because they're the authors. Right. There's a ton of membership plugins. Go back and you look at all the ones that we reviewed. Membership is a membership. It's protecting content that you don't have access to. That's, that's the basics. But how did this author, how did this company create this plugin? Did, were, how are they thinking about membership and, ma and maintaining memberships? Um, and member press has seemed to at least hit the workflow that we always think. Yeah. Like we want to have groups. We want to have this, these rules that pass people along yep. and sure the other plugins might have it, but it might not be segmented well within mm -hmm. the, within the options, right? It might not be just clear, clear cut as member press is right. Uh, besides that works right out of the box with PayPal stripe um, and a bunch of, bunch of other uh, gateways. Yeah. So basically the way it works, um, actually I would, I would, I would, I would rescind that and say PayPal and stripe with the business model, which is $99 to jump into pricing okay. a little bit. Yep. And then you also get authorize added to it as well. So PayPal, Stripe, and authorize, uh, if you do the developer licensing, and the developer licensing, of course, unlimited websites, unlimited subscriptions, although the business one is also unlimited subscriptions on one website, and the developer license is $199. We'll mm -hmm. have the pricing, I'm sure, list shown, shown for you. You also get priority support with the developer licensing, mm -hmm. and both of them have support for the first year in yeah. included. So when we talk about how e like how easy it is to use, you know, let's talk like when you first install it, you have to set up your basic pages. Mm -hmm. And in this plugin, it's a thank you page. It's the unauthorized page. You don't have access to this content. Yep. The account page where you'll see your account settings yep. and, and the login page where you log in. Yep. So it, it, at first I was looking at it. I'm like, oh, here it is. It's the same kind of membership plugin. Like I have to pick a page, which means I got to go make a page. Make a page. Yeah. Then I was just... I, 
that was like the first thing that came into my head because we yeah. experienced that in the past. Yes. I didn't realize that right in the option, it says auto create page. It'll do it for you. Yep. Um, so it made all those pages for me. Some other plugins do that, but, but I don't know. It's something about just having it right there, just pages in front yep. of me and no other options for me yep. to consider mm -hmm. just pages. And yep. then we, then we move to the account. Yep. Like how does the accounts, how do the accounts set up? Then the payments and then how does it send emails? Does it integrate with MailChimp and Aweber and all that good stuff? But then down in the, in the actual options panel on the sidebar, groups, products, rules, coupons, subscriptions, transactions, they're all separate from each other. Yep. So I create my groups of membership levels. I can then create my products, Yep. Um, which could be standalone products that people are actually buying from you. Yeah. Um, or the product is that, that membership piece. Yeah. Right? So if you want access to exclusive content, maybe there's a video series that somebody charges, charges money for, you can be part of that team or you can just sell something. Right. Like anything else, uh, rules like? rules is is super powerful. And this is what I that we both yeah. really liked. Yeah, is you can set up your rules uh, on how, um, you know what happens. Somebody signs mm -hmm. up, and in seven days I can drip out this content yeah. to them. Yeah, I can drip out this content that has all these child pages underneath it. So like a whole chapter of a book, if yeah. you will, yeah. could be you know you know sent out. Yeah, um, it's pretty powerful. And again, Absolutely. some other plugins are doing this and go back and, and, and watch those. But it's just something about having it separated like this that I, I just really like. That is really nice. In my yeah. mind, it's just nice and organized. You'll, you'll remember me from the other series of uh, membership plugins as that guy that showed up and talked about whether or not the plugin had content drip or not. Right. So for me to see this was great. You can ex uh, expire certain content or drip it. You can select it by single posts within with an attack. You know, you can go da 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 whatever you need to do. Um, I also really liked how right built into the creative pay, creative product, just like um, you're creating a post. Very, very again, very, very much built on the WordPress core foundation there um, for their dashboard um, editing tools, but also giving you the option right there to set a trial period and set the cost for the trial, so you can have a free trial. Then you can have it's just it was really great. Yeah, um, really easy refund support. I really liked too. I I, I saw in one of the option pages. Mm -hmm. uh, coupons having coupons built in. Um, again, some other other ones do this, but you just hit add coupon. It creates a generic coupon code for you. You don't even have to type yeah. out your own coupon code. Yeah. You can if you want. It's already just generated for you. It's just like, oh, I didn't have to think about yeah. that. Like, number, of, number of uses. You could say first hundred people on the website to use this coupon code. Get it. Exactly. And it's just so, it's just easy. Yeah. You know, it's just easy. <laughs> it's all right there. Yeah. Right. You apply it to which product yeah. that you want it to apply yeah. to. So if you want multiple coupons that only worked on certain products, you can do it. Mm -hmm. Um, so I really liked it. The reporting, clean, fast. Um, yeah, there's you know. a there's a report um, widget built right into the dashboard, right so you can check dashboard. that out whenever you log into your uh, the, yep. the back end there. Check yeah, so out. I mean, I really like it. Um, it's something I think that we're going to start to to use yeah. on our on our projects. Um, I mean, what else do you have? Anything else? I really don't know what else I can say. I really. <laughs> this is the part where we talk about negatives, but. Um, yeah, I mean, there. I I don't, you know, so I guess the rules cost money. I don't yeah, know. <laughs> I know. Yeah, you have to pay oh, for boy, this. Yeah. You have to pay for all this <laughs> awesome stuff to run my business and make a million bucks. Yeah. Uh, you know, maybe with the rules. I mean, this is just something that's super finite. But you know, I'd love to be able to, like we talked about, drip. Yeah, right. um, you know, rules of rules, I guess, or, yeah, or rules or, of rules. There isn't like a there isn't a hierarchy of of elements for your for your rules right. with regards to you know within this tag you know, waterfall your content of, mm -hmm. you know, this, this set of posts, you do have to do it manually, but I mean, yeah, I mean, that's, that's that probably takes, yeah, that's minor. That's minor. Um, and, and then even in the, even as we look now in the rules, there's just so many different things that right. you can do right. uh, on, on single orders. If somebody ordered everything, you could send them a coupon on a coupon. You could have a rule that said, you know, you use this coupon, so you only have access to this content free for seven days and right. then, and then we pull it away. Mm -hmm. It's, it's pretty powerful that's stuff great. still. Yeah. So, member press do recommend it. Uh, what is the website? Uh, uh, I think it's just member. Just memberpress dot com. Oh, let's well, let's, let's actually get that for people so they actually know. I have it right here. Yeah, memberpress dot com. Yep. Awesome. Um, and like I said, they they seem to be like pretty knowledgeable guys and gals. Um, going to be interviewing the founder uh, hopefully within a couple of weeks, um, so we can actually meet the guy who put this all together. Absolutely. Um, and they were very responsive and receptive uh, to yeah. us uh, to look at it. So that's probably why people were like, "Hey, check, check this <laughs> out." Check this out. Or a lot of people wanted to know. So there right. you go. Tell us what you guys thought yeah. uh, in the comments below. And
Absolutely. Uh, if you have any other plugins, themes, or something else of WordPress you want us to review, mm -hmm. if you're liking the show, go ahead and hit subscribe. Do let us know what you want. How can we help you? How can we create better content uh, that's going to help with your business or WordPress stuff? Uh, let us know. SiliconStudio.com slash blog slash subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys.